the Jesus claimed to be God, part 16. In part 15, I explained how the prophecies were not corrupted and how they were not taken out of context. So if this is your first time on my account, I made 16 videos so far explaining and showing proof of how Jesus claimed to be God, how he fit the Messiah and God's description, and how none of the scriptures were altered. And I did a full in-depth explanation of how the scriptures are reliable in my proving Jesus existed series, so you can go check that out. Anyways, if you've been following along, you might be wondering why Jesus couldn't just say the three simple words, I am God, and just avoid all this confusion. Now let me ask you, if a person ran outside right now and yelled, I am God, would you believe him? No, obviously not. You'd automatically think that he's a delusional person and not pay much attention to him. Only a human would claim to be God by saying that I am God. But Jesus was not just a human, he was God. So he revealed himself by showing that he was God instead of saying that he was God. I already went over this in my previous part so you can see that. Also, Jesus even takes the name I am, which is the name of the God of Israel. So you might be wondering why this even matters. So what if Jesus claimed to be God and fit all the descriptions? Well, it does matter and it's very important. So go check out part 17 to see me explain why it matters.